The week started off so promisingly, didn't it, Sarah? But it's gone rapidly downhill. Yeah, that's absolutely right, Polly. We're in British summertime now. Yesterday was quite spring-like, but today we have seen quite a lot of rain around. The rain did ease, though, during the afternoon, and actually it's been an improving picture. So we've had some lovely scenes in from our weather watchers. This one taken from the church tower in Rye, looking over the rooftops. So you can see we had a bit of blue sky and sunshine. There's also been some pretty hefty showers, though, over the past few hours and then over the next couple of days it's going to be pretty chilly there will be further spells of rain at times particularly tomorrow but some brighter spells as well as we look towards the Easter weekend. But the reason things are so unsettled is because we've got low pressure in charge. One area of low pressure sitting to the north of the UK and the next weather front moving its way in from the southwest. That's going to be bringing us some rain later tonight. But let's look at the radar image. So this is where the rain's been falling over the past few hours. You can see those hefty showers that are now just clearing off the East Kent coast. But we've still got one or two just lingering around Margate, for instance, over the next hour or so. But overnight tonight, those showers clear. So things are looking largely dry, but still quite cloudy and chilly too. And through the early hours of Wednesday morning, then the next area of rain moves in from the west. So a soggy start to Wednesday across Sussex and Surrey. Kent starting off largely dry, but I think we're all going to be seeing the rain moving in. Some fairly heavy bursts of rain through the middle part of the morning, but then the rain should ease a little later on. So by the middle of the afternoon, some sunnier spells breaking through, but it will be the coldest day of the week. So look at those temperatures, just five to seven degrees. So well below what we'd expect for the time of year and that'll be followed by a cold night Wednesday into Thursday morning we are expecting to see some frosty conditions with those temperatures in the countryside just dropping below freezing first thing Thursday morning but Thursday should bring some sunshine through the day later on in the day there'll be more cloud moving in from the west and you've guessed it some more showers around too but it won't be quite as chilly as it will on Wednesday Looking ahead towards the Easter weekend, we've got this area of low pressure that stays in charge. So showers at times, but it won't be a complete write-off. There'll be a little bit of sunshine in between as well. So we can hope for a, a bit of brightness here. It's hopeful. Glimmer it? of hope, isn't mm. it? Glimmer of Thanks, hope. Sarah.